oh dark, like <laughs> science dark. kind of. It's tough to get high school no. students excited about wow. science, yeah. but that's exactly what a group of UC San Diego graduate students are doing thanks to a new initiative here on campus called the Socrates Fellows Program. Right, now it's, actually it's designed to bring scientific research to high school classrooms uh, and to help graduate students numbers. become better teachers. UC San Diego professor Martin Crispeels heads the program, which just received a $3 million grant from the National Science Foundation. What's exciting about this grant is that uh, we hope that it will help us address a major national problem, which is that uh, there are not enough science students in the science pipeline. So, so this school year, UCSD the, grad students working on their PhD are pairing up with high school teachers to bring more science into the classroom. For 10 hours a week, they will work with students on experiments and activities that are directly related to their graduate research. It's also going to help me develop more exciting curriculum for my students and really give students sort of the face of science and um, make them feel that it's something that they can do. Besides sharing their passion for science, the graduate students will also gain hands-on teaching experience themselves. I'd like to be a professor someday and there's literally no teaching experience for college professors. I wanted to um, have some experience working with, with teachers, get some insights from them as far as how they approach um, instruction, and then also have some experience working with students um, and, and gain some experience with developing those interactions. By being in the classroom, graduate students can also break down some common stereotypes about scientists. They're not all white-haired European professors, but there are women, there are minorities, there are all kinds of people who do science and who can bring their own science to the classroom. And that way, young people will get excited about science. The equation the, for the line is, is here. This summer, the graduate students got a chance to test drive and refine the activities they developed. They worked with high school students who were taking part in an outreach program on campus. And judging by the reaction of these high schoolers, the program is already a success. It's, it's pretty interesting. I didn't think it would be this interesting. It's, open, it's opening eyes to, to areas of science that I had never really had an interest for before. It's different than being in a classroom setting where you're just, okay, well, we're learning this procedure. It's nice and all, but when you're in an, oh, an actual lab, you get the feeling that yeah. it's got real-life applications, that you just don't get that sense when you're in your high school classroom. It's really important, and it, you start opening up your mind to this idea that maybe I, too, can do this when I get older. It's going really well. The students seem to be genuinely interested in the activity that we've uh, put together for them. A lot of things have come together over the last couple of weeks that have uh, really made this a rich experience for the students. Oh, yeah. Smaller.